what is up everyone welcome back to the channel in this video we're going to be doing a calisthenics workout and then i'm going to show you guys a post-workout meal that i'm going to have but first i do got to get to work so let's go all right work was good i hope you all have been good as well now starting off right here we're going to do some 50 pull-ups now don't mind about you know the rep ranges or anything like that you know if you can only do one pull up at a time do one pull up at a time you know it's all about your own progress there are people that can do even more than 50 pull-ups so um you know tailor it to uh your skill level and just go from there so just you know focus on the squeeze of the muscle and uh, just keep your form solid that's really all i can say now for the dips definitely this is also going to be working a lot of the shoulders arms especially the chest as well great exercise and it makes it even harder by uh, balancing here um, so definitely the rings help out with that and I this is literally only my third time using the rings so it definitely is a big challenge but not only is the external workouts that we do important but it's also what we fuel our body with as well so make sure that you're also treating your body right and um, eating the right foods that doesn't mean you got to go necessarily vegan, but I would try and keep your foods um, toward a whole food uh, kind of lifestyle. Um, obviously, I am vegan, so I'm going to push that kind of lifestyle. But um, regardless, this is still a great exercise and workout to do. Um, just make sure you're eating the right nutrition along the way um, to help and make sure you're maximizing your gains. But yeah, so just practicing some more of these dips right here. I definitely want to emphasize and get my chest a little bit bigger so all these dips are great just take your time going down focus on the negative now right here doing 40 rows this is going to target more of your back um, just squeeze at the top slow on the way down squeeze at the top explode and then relax going down and focus on that negative because uh, the negatives are going to be um, your best friend in terms of making gains as well so that's really a good thing definitely let me know what you guys want to see in the next video i'm always taking your guys requests especially in the fitness um, aspect let me know what you guys want to see in the next video now we're going to do 50 push-ups here and like i said scale the workout up or down depending on your skill level but i do like these push-ups with the rings just because um, when you do it on a normal floor obviously the floor limits how far you can go so when using the rings you can get a deeper stretch so you can work more of your, your muscle fibers in your chest. Um, so drawing more blood to it and obviously uh, helping it grow more. So that's also a good thing. And just, you know, even though it's only 50 push-ups, if you go slow and controlled, it's going to feel like 100. So just take your time with it. Enjoy it. Have fun. That's the main thing with working out. You're supposed to do stuff that you're enjoying. Now right here, I was actually just messing around and uh, trying to see if I can you know balance um in certain ways so i'm trying to honestly i'm trying to learn new skills uh, i've seen some youtube videos that actually got inspired to make this one from from a youtuber that makes videos um you know using the rings so i thought this would be pretty cool to try and um, at least get my balance up and learn new skills along the way but yeah definitely focusing on nutrition i'm going to show you the post workout uh pretty shortly after this exercise and another now the post-workout meal was also inspired by goku pump and broly gains so i just modified it to what i had in my house honestly and uh yeah so i'll definitely show you that just doing more of these dips right here uh, like i said i do want to emphasize the chest a little bit more because um i feel like my the middle of my chest and maybe a little bit of the lower chest is a little bit lacking so i'm definitely just focusing on this and this is a really good exercise to balance it's like an l sit it even targets some of your abs as well 
um, really good for the core and uh, working the shoulders out. So just, uh, you can even set like a timer. You can, you know, do one minute sets where you're just holding yourself there if you can. But uh, it was kind of difficult, I'm not gonna lie, but um, that's why we practice and we get better over time. And, you know, any movement is key, you know, just, just exercising in general is key. But here is the dish I had. Look at this plate right here. We had sweet potatoes, avocado, beans, bean sprouts, broccoli, uh, peppers, onions, and just a whole bunch of uh, nutritional yeast, salt, pepper, garlic. So I just seasoned it up. And I'm telling you, this plate was insane. Like it doesn't even look that like, doesn't even look like that much food, but I'm telling you, this plate was probably one of the best plates I've ever had and in a while. So at least that I've made myself. So definitely try it out and let me know what you think. Here's a little update of my current physique. I'm at 145 pounds. Again, I'm five foot nine. All right, so that's gonna wrap up the video. Hope you all enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And remember, health is wealth. And as always, I'm out. Later.